Hello everyone, this is Easy the Gamer and we are back with Horizon Zero Dawn. The time has come. At this point, based on everything, I am 99.0%. I finish every side quest, every errand that I can found. I have pretty much the outfits, the weapons, the collectibles. I have I mean, what more can I do? The only thing, the frozen wilds. That's the only thing that I still don't have. But that's for the next, you know, the next uh, group of videos that I do. I have everything. I mean, <laughs> I, I have done everything. So now it's pretty much the quest. The looming shadow. The Hades intends to use this fire to transmit a resurrection signal calling millions of very war machines from their grave. When the time comes, Aloy must stand against the shadow, but she will not fight alone. I have to go to the Palace of the Sun, and that's pretty much it. I already have the armor, really cool armor actually. So, yeah, there's nothing else to do. I think I am fully equipped. The final battle has come. And with the armor that I have, even better. Not only that, I actually have this. Oh, it's really cool. It, it, it's actually a great combination with the armor. Yeah, there's nothing else, people. That's it. The ending has finally come. Uh, I got the armor, everything. I finished, again, I finished everything of the game. That's the fire there. That's what Haiti won. That seems to be like a signal tower. But it actually doesn't seem like one, so that's why it's so weird. There are no shadows in the noonday sun. Okay. Is it just me or they seem like more organized this time? This fight's going to be at night. It's actually it's really cool because okay, I'm here. Talk to the Sun King of uh. Don't let your guard down. Yeah, I know, I know. Don't let my guard down. Oh, wait a second. I didn't even notice. Hey, Aaron. You still want to talk? I might need a hanky. No. Nope. I hope so. Wow, this guy's still there. Sunky of a. Here we go. Wait a second. I don't see anything else. Hello, Sun King. You do pretty well. Hey, Lord. What brings you to Meridian? <laughs> a threat. Helis commands a legion of fanatics called the Eclipse. They will attack soon from the west with an army of ancient war machines. But that's not the worst of it. They'll bring a mind with them. God, demon, machine, whatever you want to call it. It's called Hades. And it doesn't want Meridian at all. Yep. It wants the Spire. And if it gets there, it will send out a call, waking more ancient machines, more than we could ever defeat. Yeah. <laughs> all will be lost. We can't let that happen. I'm trying to understand, but <laughs> my responsibility lies with Meridian. 
Meridian isn't the target of Odd. You have to defend the Spire. Yeah. Perhaps the Vanguard, your radiance. Yes. Send them to the Spire. Aaron knows Aloy. He won't question it. Yeah. And have the city guard fortify the western ridge. There they can be seen to protect Meridian and the Alight with Spire rests. Oh. Aloy. Allow me to apologize for my behavior before. After everything that happened with Ursa, nah, there's no problem. I was confused. If we're to fight together on the brink of life and death, I'd prefer to do so with your forgiveness. Then you have it. <laughs> as long as you don't confuse me with her again. Even yeah. a king can learn his lesson. Good then. I'm I'm glad that's behind us. Now. It will take time to prepare our defenses. Please, tell me what you know of our enemies. Everything. Yeah. I don't know about everything, <laughs> but I'll tell you what yeah, I Yeah, telling everything is like is crazy. Talk to the blameless. Okay. Have you spoken to Blameless Murad? No. Not yet, but I will. He wishes to speak to you. Defensive preparations are his responsibility. Huh. Have you spoken to Blameless? I will. He wishes to speak. Okay, let's call to the Blameless. Okay, Blameless, where are you? Let's see where the heck is. Oh, there he is. <laughs> Quietly does it. Panic in the city will only create another enemy. And do keep me appraised of each new arrival. <laughs> go, 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 go. Hello, blameless. Ah, Aloy. Preparations are underway on the rigid defenses of that spire. Word was sent to every corner of the Sundom. Our allies offered their steel. Some came from Meridian, others for shards. Yeah. But many came from you. By name. Yeah. From yeah, she's famous. <laughs> you don't be so humble. Yeah, the ridge. The ridge will be the front line. That's where the city guard are holding. Yes, bolstered by some of the uh, irregulars I saw <laughs> before. Oh, well, irregulars! The Osiran cannons that thundered Meridian's walls in the liberation. Will now defend us. Oh, okay. You're welcome to tour the defenses. Uh, the spire? And the spire. Aaron and the vanguard are there? Indeed. Uh, clashing breastplates together and testing out their battle cries, I suppose. <laughs> A number of the Nora have also arrived at the Oh, spire. hell yeah. They have resisted the offer of a royal audience. Perhaps you could parlay with them. I will. Yeah, I'm pretty much their leader, so... They have to do everything that I, I say. I suppose all we can do is wait for the attack. Exactly. It's not a feeling I cherish, but our spotters at evening sign report there's still no movement in the west. So, if there's more you need to do elsewhere, seize this time to do it. Otherwise, I've made the apartment of Olin Delverson available to you. You can sleep there, if sleep comes. Oh, Olin. <laughs> Okay. Rest before. Okay. Oh. By the sun, an attack is coming. Oh, by the way, this is something I noticed. Uh, let me see something first. Okay. So yeah, this is the ridge. Very interesting area to fight. Yeah, it may send that this is going to be most machines. It may send that they're going to come from this position here, in this fire. Okay. Okay, I can rest here. Yes. Uh, something that happening is. These are, I think, these are the locks that were damaged. Well, now they are. Okay. So these are the locks, and then they are appearing. Yeah, there's like. Yeah, there's a one, two, three, four. 
this is Gaia's log. Yeah, these are the journals. Uh, I'm not going to read them. I'll read them maybe later. There's just so much information here. I mean, I can try to read them. Let me see if I can read them fast. This is the Soviet journal, the first one. Uh, just wrapped inspection at Gaia Prime site. Construction is well underway. Reactor installed. Plans for control room. Remind me of Starship bridges on this GCO S SFVs. Uh, living spaces for alphas already completed. Prefab modules. Fingers crossed. We never have to seal ourselves in here. Not that Elysium sounds much better. Spent last week at the Bright site. Des designing. Uh, what is that? SD project labs. Drawing up protocols. The base for repurposing was used, plenty of room for workspaces and residence blocks. The works crew uh, already set up my office lab. I'm not a fan of these glass walls. Guess Murray. Murray's intention was to encourage, encourage me as all seeing presence. <laughs> uh, opposite effect. Ugh, opposite effect. Make me feel washed on display. Uh, tempted to paint it over. Harris recorded his presentation yesterday suitable, suitably bleak, scheduled to record mine Friday. As soon as the session launched, Hollow Theaters and the first resident block at SD, a CD a sites are finished. We'll start processing the candidates being held outside Tuscan 27 already, extraction team prioritizing fact ring and Aussie candidates, uh, Pacific ring and Aus Australian candidates. How scared and confused they must be, snatch off the streets, shard carted across the the world, hell in cells. Here's hoping they understand once they see the big picture. Going to catch a few hours of hours sleep here, then fly back to the SD side. The CD, uh, the CD uh, side. Harris promised delivery of the QB lattices by noon. Expect. Uh, will take two weeks to machine assemble and test. I am to launch Gaia, uh, uh, something there grounding from where I'll spin her up past one point Terra T. I wonder how long it'll take to break the one point Terra T record. Uh, Emma can go hand, <laughs> Mia can go hand, sleep. <laughs> okay. And the next one is the uh, last time I visited. Wait a second. 11 and 7 Last time I visited Prime was November of last year. Months since has been a blur. I flew out last night to oversee installation of the center of Mar armature and the master override. Your welcome tech, which was completed by 0430. So I decided to grab a, a few hours of sleep here before heading back to the CD call Gaia before I bed it down ostensibly to update her on the site plan but the truth is I miss her I develop a habit of speaking to her before I sleep seems to be the only thing that calms me these days woke, uh, woke to a message from Oswald the Odyssey launched yesterday so terrestrial life change her uh, terrestrial life chance of survival has doubled why then do I feel une so uneasy? uneasy? I just keep wondering what kind of world Far Cynic uh, will create if the ship reaches its destination so many decades from now. And I worry about the Alpha Bill of Apollo. So much knowledge, so few restraint, and no failsafe. How will they avoid repeating our mistake? What's to stop them from playing God? Uh, forwarded the Odyssey message to the Alpha. Naoto reply in less than a minute with a poem of course the building of the ship by Longfellow and it's long <laughs> alright I didn't read all of it but it seems it seems to be about launching a ship rather than building one the stanza or couplet or whatever lip on uh, me humanity with all its fears with all its hopes of future years is hanging breathless on thy fate yeah, Odyssey and Zero Dawn both. Speaking of which, I should get back to the CD. Uh, guess I should uh, stop by Naoto's lab and check on Demeter's process progress. 
to uh, if I can get out of there without a volume of Tennyson pressing to my hand I'll call myself lucky till next time far cynics okay okay I'm afraid all we can do is wait get some rest at Owen's apartment or tend to other matters I know waiting is tiresome but perhaps you have unfinished business to attend to <laughs> if you have nothing more to do I suggest getting some rest at Owen's apartment I'm afraid all we can do is wait get some rest at Owen's apartment the final battle yeah I know no shut up well, let's talk Let's talk to to the king to say something else. I'm trying to understand, but <laughs> my responsibility lies with Meridian. Uh, you have done enough. I'm trying to understand, but my responsibility lies with Meridian. Damn. Well, let's see if Harris has something new to say. And you're back. Nope. I have things. You always do. Okay, so I have to go. Well, let me see what happens if I go. I mean, the only way to go down there is to pretty much. Oh, there's the other one. Yeah, it's little by little. So I think I already seen this, right? Everyone needs a splash of color. Yeah, I don't know why I said it again, but come, let's talk it over. Well, let me see something here. I never would have expected you to bring down Red Maw. I'm kicking myself for not seeing your potential from the beginning. Okay, I don't think there's anything here, so I'm going to go down. I'm not going to go down that, the, how do you call it? Those elevators are way too slow. Oh, so much. I gotta say, I have done a lot of here. I mean, a really a lot of it. Yeah. This is not optional for me. I have to go and do this. Yeah, it says only those two, right? Yeah. Review preparations at the ridge and on the spire. Of course. Uh, isn't that a little? Look to me for help. What? My duty is to Nothing. guard. I don't get involved in politics. politics. <laughs> <laughs> Forget I said anything. You look very dignified. Don't wow. You? And shiny. Very shiny. There. So there's pretty much everyone here. Oh, Elida. Elida. Yeah, I'm, Elida. I'm pleased to see you, but what are you doing here? <laughs> I'm helping prepare for the battle. If a troll were here, we would have fought together. I know it. Oh, this is just the... So I'm doing everything I can. This is the pair, one from the Shadow Karja and herself. Digging battlements, collecting herbs, anything that makes a difference. I can't take his place. Nothing can take his place. But I'm here for him, for both of us. I understand what it was he saw in you. He'll always be with me. Sun and shadow still meet for a moment, every dawn and dusk. I should give you this, to help in the battle. By the sun, I hope you don't need it. Thank you, Alita. Be safe. Oh, three antidote. Thank you for that. Father understood that I couldn't just stand by in my garden. Maybe this battle can finally end the war between the Karja. I should finish up here before the fighting starts. 
father understood that I couldn't just stand by in my body. Oh, I can see that there's like some type of... So am I supposed to go up there or something? Watch out for the Asuram merchants. They'll assume cheat you as look at you. Okay, there's nothing. How many men do you think you'll kill in the battle, Luther? As many as I have to. Wow. I love it when you say things like that. It's so... What? Cheerful. <laughs> hey, there's Teb here. I told you I'd be here. You did, Teb. But have your wounds even had time to heal? They better. Honestly, if I fought, I'd probably come undone. But don't worry. I'll leave that to the other north. Okay. Fine. I brought supplies instead. These Karja have made me an honorary quartermaster. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds impressive. I could get used to it. We'll be setting up caches of arms and medicine under these banners. Look for them when the fighting starts. Aloy, when you went into the mountain, did the goddess tell you our chances? Ah, uh, fifty fifty. She didn't need to. <laughs> I know we can do this, Tab. Maybe we can. There's a guard under the last cave. This place. Far cry from those days. Really couldn't be more different to the sacred land, could it? Okay, hey, this a new one? Okay, yeah, this is a new one. Travis came by trick or treating dressed up like me. Uh, Should have seen that coming. I gave him a half eaten packet of dandy wa wafers as a treat and kicked him out. But not before he invited me to some kind of Italian horror extravaganza. He organized for a uh, CD uh, staff. Uh, seriously, I still. Uh, though there isn't enough horror in the world already. Anyway, I was, I was already scheduled to fly out here to G Prime for final inspections with Harris and the president delegation. That was there t was here too, and he was not looking good. Kept fidgeting and couldn't seem to look me in the face without blinking. I was relieved when he boarded his bird uh, and flew back to Tevez. Uh, there's a gap there. Though I guess I shouldn't complain if he wants to build himself a deluxe shelter to ride out the apocalypse, let him get him out of illusion and away from me. Harris stuck around long enough to get me a, de a detailed briefing on the strategic situation. Basically we entered the terminal phase as though the color of the sky when I was flying over here wasn't cool enough. Another two or three weeks and the atmosphere won't be breathable. The last vestiges of European and West African sieve Brigades are trapped with their backs against the Atlantic. The swarm that scuttled across Antarctica is crossing the Strait of Magellan. Magellan. About to start its death crawl up to South America towards the Amazon. All the work we did to reconstitute the rainforest and it comes to this. An advanced element of the Pacific Swarm already skirming, skirmishing with units of the Kalmar Seawall. The noose is light is tightening. Projections show we can still finish in time, but the margin of error is plus minus uh, 10 days. Not a good spread. If the play breaks through ahead of schedule, well, it just can. I will not let that happen. Enough writing. I need to get back to zero dawn. Oh, things not looking good. There are materials like I've never seen in the markets above. Going too soft. Too much Osiron influence at the palace. I tried to explain stitchers and makers to these Karja. you think that wouldn't take much explaining. Well, at least we got to talk to a lot of them. Really couldn't be more different than the secret land. Yeah. yeah. It's better. There are materials like I've never seen in the markets above. Hello. Little Huntress. My two favorite Paul, characters. So here I am. <laughs> Ready to fight? Hell yeah. Fight? I thought you just wanted tea and conversation. No. Is there a battle coming? I wasn't informed. Wow. <laughs> well, that can't be true. You're always informed. Yeah. Ah, so I am. We've only met a few times, and yet you know me so well. I don't think I know you at all. But I'd like to. Hmm. When I hear that line, it usually means something else. Can I tell you a secret? Yeah, what is it? I've been waiting for this fight my whole life. 
The enemy we face today is the same that turned Meridian into a slave pit and Sunfall into a bloodbath. Yeah. Fanatics who torture and murder mothers, fathers, families, children, and say it's the will of the sun. I hate them, Aloy. I've got the scars of their whips on my back to prove it. And today, we can get rid of them once and for all. I said I came for you, but that was only <laughs> half the truth. I came for them. I do like her clothing, time, although I like the other one better. I'm with you the finish. fighting one. We'll fight them together. I hope she put it because that's the best it, one. Huntress. Huh. Tomorrow, may the sun rise in a better world. Oh, I hope so. I only fight when I have to, but by the time I have to, I usually want to. <laughs> I put something special on the tips of my arrows for the eclipse. Okay, what is it? It's too bad Bahavas isn't here to oh, see yes. his little <laughs> friends crushed. Well, I only fight when I have to. Then not say but victory by the time I have to, I usually want to. Oh, let me talk to you too. Hey, Loy. <laughs> um, at ease, Rupert. <laughs> Meridian will be glad to have you on its side. And the I samurai. The honor is mine. You saved my epitaph from being a fine soldier but a fool of a man. I'm hoping you won't need any kind of epitaph just yet. As the sun wills. When you found me, I was trying to eke out a glorious death. But now, a glorious life seems more preferable. To watch Edelman play in the low gardens again. Still surrounded by a dozen guards, but <laughs> what you did, Aloy, hey, the little kid. it was done well. <laughs> Although I can't like, shake like, like Vanasha is like it's just like the the head. That was a weird transition there. <laughs> Vanasha. She delights in goading me. Like brazen colors wave before a behemoth. Ah, uh, she's you there. Need to ask her to stop. Yeah. No. <laughs> well I accept it. Yeah, they like each other. I, I think this. Meridian shall stand and shadow shall fall. I do like the I wolf swear. of them. Here's to that, Ufid. Yes. The sun is my armor. This other armor I wear is a safeguard. No, I think that's the best Always armor you have. <laughs> for a sun king. Always for Meridian. Every battle we hope to make the last. For the other side. The sun is my armor. Yeah. This other armor I wear is a safer armor. Again, this is the better armor. Holy crap. How many people do I have to talk? Who the heck is this? Nakoa. Oh, Nakoa. <laughs> you came to fight. How could I not? During the Red Raids, there was only one Karja Butcher the Nora feared more than Zaid. He was. Yeah. I would stand against any army he leads, no matter how strong. For the Nora he terrorized, for myself, and for my father. We'll stop him. You have my word. Your word means a lot, especially now. Because of you, I hear the sacred land is open. If you win, yeah, that's I true. can go home. It'll be good to see Jan again. <laughs> I'm with you, Ayla. Don't say those things. Those things mean that you're going to die. Like you said, we'll stop Helis cold. Together. Oh, you better. I hear they call you the anointed now. Yeah. <laughs> the matriarchs and the rituals. Jan's probably eating it up. It's strange to fight alongside the Karja. But I guess they're like any tribe. Some kind, some vicious. Yeah. Like you said, we'll stop Helis cold. Together. I hear they call you the anointed now. I like that, that we're the seeing everything like... All the characters. Oh, there she is. The, the from the prison. Geneva, they called you back to duty. So you're the one behind all this commotion. Who made Sun King Avad finally show his sword arm from behind those robes? <laughs> a king can be fierce and fair, Geneva. He's a good man. A smart man too. He had Murad offer all my prisoners a royal pardon if they'd fight for Meridian. Holy crap! The whole motley lot of them agreed. Of course. Didn't take much convincing. <laughs> With your kind of convincing, I don't doubt it. Ha! This time I went easy on them. Those who commit the crime of attacking Meridian, they'll see less of my lenient side. May the sun blaze at your back, Aloy. That's a nice 
Oh, this girl. She's always talking to like Uti. Can't fault my prisoner's discipline. All those dawn drills have served him well. After it's all over, I might be the only one going back to the rock. Not to like that. I've waited two years for this war to break. I can wait a little longer. Can't fault my prisoner's discipline. All those dawn drills have served him well. Him? From the Battle of the Dawn? Can be. Cinnabar Sands was before that. And there were no survivors. Well, I don't like to boast. Oh, son, keep the shadow from falling upon me. <laughs> Holy crap, this fool, I think it is. It's Neil. It's here. It's not there. Are you going to have a fight here? Hey, you know. <laughs> They told me your name. I said, hair like a splash of blood, tenacious as a scrapper's jaws. I've thought about what you said. Every time the wound you gave me caught in my ribs. Riley. I didn't wound you. Exactly. Not by metal. Exactly. Still, I forget. A duel is such a fleeting joy. If one of us had ended the other, we'd have missed all this. The weight of the blood is shed. Like the scrape of a blade across your teeth. Now he can now kill all our machines. You're making it difficult to be glad to and see And people. You. <laughs> but you're needed. Yeah. The battle will be hard. Hard? I was assured the odds would be near impossible. <laughs> and you signed up anyway? Exactly. Impossible odds, fine company, killing without consequence. How could I resist? Aren't you glad that I didn't kill you? Killed anyone lately you'd like to talk about? Ah, yeah, Bahavas. Machines, but I hear these ones are demons. That's exciting. Trouble with a battle is, it can be hard to find killing to call your own. Killed anyone lately you'd like to talk about? You know, that's right. I have to agree with him. Because everyone is killing at the same time. It's like... What the heck is this? Oh, I think I know where, where this is going. Petra's going to give me that weapon to test it. Petra. Yeah. Here she is. The guest <laughs> of honor. I knew there was something about you. Hammered from the stuff they make leaders out of. And I don't say that to every Nora girl who blows through my town. That happens to you a lot? <laughs> Had to build a wall to fend them off. <laughs> Good thing I'm persistent then. <laughs> I've missed our little talks. Murad asked me to look over the city arsenal. These guns have aged well. That runs in the Osram, no? They were the pride of the mainspring forges. So I've taken greater pride in improving them. So these are the weapon that they use in the fight, I believe. Can I try one? Everybody wants a turn. Exactly. Have at it then. The target should put up a little less of a fight than those bandit raiders did. Thank you. You don't need to worry about me. Made it nice and wide. No need to aim at the bow. Be good. Try the next. Oh, no. no. Uh, they're running away. See? That'll knock a machine on its ass, ancient or no. With these, I think we could hold off an army. You know that I appreciate <laughs> your help, Petra. This battle up. I don't know what's gonna happen. We'll see each other again, I know it. Next time could be the time I'll convince you to stick with the free heat. Oh. Petra, you know I can. I do, yeah. I do. <laughs> Always had a weakness for restless girls, though. I don't make weapons for a living. It's more of a diversion. The city always ground my gears. But I'd miss it if it were gone. You take care of yourself and the cannons. Oh, don't worry. The cannons are going to be okay. I don't okay. make weapons for a living. It's more of a diversion. Yeah, I'm going to use a, a horse. I'm not going to go all the way there. I called him a horse. What the heck is this? Is a goddamn horse? Oh, this battle is not going to be easy. Or It's 
that another one? No, it's the same one. Okay. I don't think there's nothing here, so... Am I supposed to go here, or...? No, it's... Someone here. You're the hunter from the Belupa. Yeah. I remember you also, Nora. The machines shook free of their slumber after you arrived. Raged and fought. Uh, well, that, that wasn't my fault. No, I'm thanking you. That night, I decided I would not go back to Banor. I would take my hunt into these lands. So many machines, even demons, spidery. Okay, so this has to be from the frozen land you know that that dlc i never seen there in them. dead things that must be killed again our enemies dug up an army of them an arm i know that some people might think let's do the frozen land but i'm going to do this first and then go back to that yes that's why i came good i'll wait from their metal bones i'll make my armor and my song My spear is sharp. My will is like the oldest ice. If I live or die, they'll call my name down glacier cracks. From their metal bones, I'll make my armor and my song. Okay. I need to be careful because I've seen that there are people here. I don't know if she's the only one. I think most of the people are in here. There's another one there. Oh, Talana. Talana. Why are you here? I don't know. Your hawk. Exactly. <laughs> Defending Meridian with a rod? I leave that to the rest of the lodge. <laughs> yes. I will not stand aside while one of mine fights alone. Not again. Are you sure you you're risking your life for all of us? You can't ask me to stand by and watch. Not when I have the power to Why is Aelo so afraid? You know, they just want to do it. It's settled. I will fight by your side. My only request... Name it. Leave the biggest machine for me. <laughs> no promises. When I understand she's afraid. I am afraid you. that they're going to die. I came prepared. I have arrows enough to take down five armies. Hawk and Thrush, ready for the battle to start. Exactly. When you need me. I'll follow your lead. I came prepared. I have arrows enough to take down five armies. Thank you for that. Uh, I think she's she's seeing this the wrong way. You know, I, I understand she's afraid, but there's nothing left. If these people has to fight. This, you know, this remember a helm steep from how do you call it, uh, Lord of the Ring. Is taller than the highest tree. These cards are in their frilled armor, look like turkeys. Oh, this is the so Nora. Many, and now we are so few. That's true. <laughs> they are not our foe. Not this time. Quiet now. She comes. She comes. The anointed. <laughs> the anointed. Oh my god. War Chief Sona. War Chief, you. You seem uncomfortable. It's true, there are not a lot, a lot of Nora. I do not belong here. <laughs> I do not belong here. I will fight the metal devil that threatens us all. But my place is in the sacred land. Yeah, I know. The wrongness here jags at me like an arrowhead. I'm sorry to put you through this. Do not be sorry. This will be ended. My spear, my <laughs> word. The cards do not impress me. To build so tall to invite the fate of the ancients we will stand tall for we are the strength of the nora your fight is ours 
You know it to be so. The cards do not impress me. The build so tall is to invite the fate of the ancients. You have to be safe. There's someone here. Oh, oh great yeah. son. How does your days fall? In approval? What the heck? Oh, approach. yeah. I know who this is. Turn our heads with your daily pilgrimage. From the east, where we came, to the west, where only you may go. You grant cold metal the warmth of life, and let the machines bask in your great shining. For you, the shadows shrink and part and gather again only at your allowance, without form. Your eyes, the day, your ears, the priests, your lips, the radiant sun king. And you're trying to hear As everything he's saying. And will be again. Naman. I should have known if there was going to be a sun priest here, it would be you. <laughs> and if the sun king had allowed outlanders to set foot upon the light, this Aloy could only be you. <laughs> I wish the circumstances were different. Or that the sound of the sun could give you peace of mind. But if you allow me one pontification. Go ahead. Yeah. You've shown strength and compassion. Our enemy is only a desperate hate. Both sides claim the blessing of the sun. But the sun that I pray to, he would bestow it upon yours. You know, Naman, I'm <laughs> already under some pretty heavy divine pressure. Yeah, she's the anointed. The tribes united against Shadow. How could that not be the sun's will? The Ataru have a proverb. Green grows from the ashes of a forest blaze. From what I could gather, the Nora believe their goddess chose them for a fated battle. The also <laughs> believe yes. in many things. The forges hiss, the charcoal's crack, the creak of the fermenting barrel. Complex omens. <laughs> the Ataru have a proverb. Green grows from the ashes of a forest place. I tried to see who is where. Who the heck are this? I know. Th oh yeah, this Monora. Don't. You don't need to bow. The anointed doesn't like it. <laughs> she <laughs> doesn't <laughs> much like me. <laughs> she said the anointed doesn't like it, but he's calling me anointed. Called anointed either. It means a lot to have you here, Laurel. I gave my word. So, Meridian, what do you think? I've seen <laughs> many new things since I first met yeah, you. Yeah, a lot of this Nora, they don't know anything I about this. But this is well, new for them. Wrong. You really want to know? Yeah. Alright. I'm in a foreign land, a tainted land, defending a faithless city that looks like nothing I've seen. From something I can't imagine. Th and you, after all that's happened, all you've done, I feel like I should drop to my knees and worship you. <laughs> I know you don't want that. Boy, things are pretty tough for you, huh? Yeah. Thanks for telling the other not to bow. It's the last thing I need. <laughs> That's the thing. The Karja are a mess, you know, of pretty much, you could say it's a version of our society if we were in this time. Don't be too hard on it. The Nora are very I'm religious, you know, very traditional and saying. Is that why you came? No. I would have and we must fight a metal devil. So and I have the Sunki, I have this guy Varl. <laughs> because you say. I think the goddess and I are in agreement. We're both glad you're here. So am I. Your friend, the vanguard, keeps looking over. Up here? I'm not sure if the world is growing bigger. Oh, I've grown smaller. I apologize for the war chief. She is hating this. <laughs> Your friend. Uh, I can't fold. Again, over. this is the first time for them. Everything. It, 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 it. How how could you accept everything here? Again, just the anointed, so they, they, ha they accept it pretty fast. But they're not really accepting it. It's just a reflex, pretty much. Is there anyone else? I'm just looking because I don't know how many people I, I'm supposed to look. I already visited this Dude, place. Who are these guys? They call themselves the Eclipse. What does that even mean? 
<laughs> it's when the moon gets in front of the sun, idiot. <laughs> Is that supposed to sound scary or something? I don't know. They used to be Karja. Karja are always yammering about sun and shade. <laughs> well, if they used to be Karja, how tough can they be? Yeah, they're best guys just like birds. We'll rip their little feathers off. Right, let's not get cocky, boys. This guy feels like something of Game of Thrones, something like that. Aloy. <laughs> so here we are again, gearing up for a fight. Only this time it sounds like the bad guys have a lot more firepower. What are we up against, really? I'm not sure. But there's gonna be a lot of them, and they'll have machines. Yep. And if they get past us, it's not just Meridian that will fall. The rest of the world will go with it. Let's... Big. <laughs> it sounds like our kind of fight. Right, guys? Hell yeah. Well, where do they put the vanguard? At, At the, the front, front of the line! line! To die. And why? Steel before iron! No, because you're you're supposed to die. And what are we gonna do? Die. Hit him like a hammer till he can't hit back. back! Damn right! You're wrong, you have you to die. That? Nobody's getting past the vanguard. We're here The Vanguard had the first one to die, that's why they're put in there. The areas. <laughs> and we're here for you. They're important, but at the same time, they're made for that, you know. <laughs> well, only if we win. Oh, well, they're supposed to be the best, so. Okay. What kind of machines have they got? Big, ugly ones. From the ancients. Ugly and ancient? Like your mother? Worse. Like your wife? <laughs> That's enough. This is what I have to deal with. <laughs> we gonna fight soon? I'm getting hungry. This guy sounds like idiots. always idiot. hungry. Feasts on me. After we win. Beer too? Beer too. Exactly. <laughs> Where's the now beer? You just can't leave me alone, can you? I think she likes you. You oh. gonna kiss her, Captain? Oh, please. Shut up. Not another now. one. We'll just pretend that never happened. Yes, I agree. What kind of machines have they got? Big ugly ones from the ancients. Ugly and ancient. Okay, I didn't like see your anyone mother. else. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is the last one I think. Of the text. Okay, such a close thing. It's been what 48, 43 hours since Harris warned me. Set collapse of the Eastern Line was imminent. Swarm launching some kind of pincer maneuver versus the Wichita salient. Fire six day more, and I think Gaia could have launched to have launched without our help. I really do. And we had to scramble. CD, CD, CD became a madhouse, absolute badland. Everything rushing to stabilize, co and lock it down. As gammas got evacuated, then betas. Uh, once Gaia was on her way, I gathered the alphas together to give them the bad news. Felt like I was going to throw up. But they already knew, of course. They knew the work wasn't really finished. Close, but not quite there. Still test to run, kings to smooth, work to do. So they accepted it. No elision for us. We we'll spent the rest of our life here testing and polishing each subordinate function to perfection. Guess that's what you get when you recruit a bunch of obser uh, obsessive perfectionists. Managed not to cry until I got back to my office. So here we are, setting up Gaia Prime, and yeah, such a close thing makes me feel nauseated uh, all over again when I contemplated how the fate of life could hinge on coincidence. If I never pro proposed the Lightkeeper protocol, there never would have been living spaces constructed here. If I'd abandoned the protocol sooner, the necessary life support system never would have been installed if... if if at least we won't have to endure the creepiness of racing and training clones of ourselves the genetic material was never processed out of the cradle size so it's not even possible for which i'm glad i really really wouldn't want to spend time around a john travis <laughs> taste raised by travis day oh that i agree with that no it'll be up to us to perfect gaia one generation only update that was General Jer Harris. The sailing has collapsed. USRC is set to be overrun in two days, which gives us 72 hours at best to lock down and seal up. Very alive for life's sake. 
I'll go tell the others. Wow. Worse, like your wife. That's enough. This is what I have to deal with. Damn, those were the last moment. I think that's everyone, right? Damn it. I'm just thinking like that guy he, he pretty much F everything up. I think that's everyone, right? to go back here yeah uh, you can read everything the, okay so the lightkeeper protocol is pretty much to design clones you know to make clones of this on themselves but she decided she didn't want that which interesting it, it, like I said this is actually a clone of her you know Alo is a clone of her this we're seeing Elizabeth Sobek reborn again pretty much but Gaia didn't have any choice if it wasn't for Teth Pharaoh this would have run smoothly it's because of him that damn it Pharaoh why why did I, I heard him he, he just became crazy you know but he messed everything up That's it. I assume this is the point of no return. I have to live it here because pretty much, yeah, I have spoken to a lot of people. I don't have to buy anything. I bought everything that I can. Well, let me see something first here. Yeah. Let me get what I can here. Goddamn rocks. I hate the rocks. I don't think I'm going to need rocks. Well, uh, you may not know. Hell no. I don't need any rocks. Oh, that's all. Well, everyone, that's all for now. I don't know how many videos are left but yeah this quests are for the others but I'm not going to do them until I finish everything I mean I should do it but I'm not going to so that's all for now uh, don't forget if you're new to the channel please subscribe hit that like button if you are enjoying this video also uh, li leave a comment and don't forget to hit the notification bell so that's all for now uh, this is easy the game and sign up for now and I will see you on the next video don't know if that's the last one but let's hope it is so yeah until next time